Hello guys, how's it going? Welcome to another Techno Tokyo Theater video. I got my JoJo hat here. It's a Loot Crate exclusive. And that's a celebration of this month's Loot Crate for the month of, I don't know if this is September or August. I'm gonna have to look it up. But what I do know is that this month's theme is back to school. Now this is my first loot crate opening and I'm pretty excited about it. Uh, but uh, if you guys like these videos please uh, like and subscribe um, because I can guarantee you I'll probably be the first to open these each month if you guys really enjoy the video. Uh, but they are a bit pricey for me even with the Crunchyroll discount. So I can't guarantee that I'm going to be getting them every month until, you know, until I see the support, of course. So, yeah. but at least for the next few months, I'll see how things go as long as I, I like the thing. So let's go ahead and unbox it. I mentioned the themes. Now, I really have, I've already watched, this is the... 11th box in the no this is the 10th box in this this style of loot uh, crates now I never really had an interest in loot crate because I'm not huge into comic books I know just about as much as any regular movie goer would know about um, I don't want to look inside yet uh, <laughs> I know just about as much as uh, any regular movie goer would know about comic books and a lot of pop culture related references and stuff so that's the reason why I never got into Loot Crate. But Loot Anime is something that interests me more because it's anime themed. Even though I've watched every past crate, most of them have not uh, really interested me that much, to be honest. Like, most of the con the items that have been in the box never seem to be what I was looking for. But I, I don't want to ramble too much. This is the only item I saw in the past crate that really interests me to the point where I went out and bought it myself. And it cost me about 25 bucks for this hat off of eBay and it's an exclusive to Loot Crate. So that's the same price as this box. So I'm hoping to get something just as awesome in here. So let's go ahead and uh, open it up. Hmm. This is, uh, I guess we'll start with this. I don't know what this. Oh, Utena. Okay. I, I, I know some of the enemies that are in this box, but uh, we'll all just be surprised that it must be a medical kit or. Medical box of some sort. I don't. I don't know. I guess we'll just have to open it up and find out. Okay, so there's like this little strap thing here. I don't know if it's gonna describe it. What the freak? Oh, it's a it's a bento box. That is pretty cool. All right, that's. See, it has like little layers for like food. You know, uh, rice and you know sushi or whatever. It has multiple layers. Look at that. There's another layer here. What what just fell out of the box was actually the chopsticks. So I'll have to pick them up in a second. And there's a bottom layer. Now I don't know. <laughs> I'm a big man, all right. So I don't know if this if this is gonna fit enough food for me for lunch. <laughs> but uh, and I'll probably just be trying to find a way to squeeze peanut butter and jelly in this in this little thing. I think I'll be taking rice and stuff to work, but uh, hey, who, who knows? Um, you never know. So let me try to get this thing reassembled real quick so we can move on to the next item. But this is pretty cool. I'm not a huge Utena fan, Revolutionary Girl Utena, but it's an older anime that uh, I, I don't think a lot of people really expected to see in these boxes. A lot of times they have like kind of more recent items, and here's the chopsticks. Um, so... There you go. And they go inside of here uh, somehow. I don't know which side goes where. Maybe they both go this way. See, because the way it popped open, like I'm not really sure how to put this stuff back. Something like that. See? And then it goes on top. So yeah, that is a pretty cool item. Uh, if you're an Utena fan, I'm sure you would love this. Uh, or just a fan of any Japanese culture uh, related things because I've never had a bento box before so it's kind of cool stuff you can get out of here it's, and it is a, a loot crate 
uh, exclusive if you can see that there. So, all right, on to the next item. Uh, let's just ruffle through here and uh, let's see what we get. I don't want to see it. Okay, so this is <laughs> this is pretty cool. I don't know why I'm gonna find a use for this, but this is from um, Dank and Rampa. All right, and uh, I don't know if this is exclusive to Loot Crate, but it's a tie. I mean, it says it there on the label, so I guess we're gonna try our, the best we can do to open this up. Okay, and uh, without damaging anything, I'm not really sure how you open it. Uh, so we can kind of get a look at what the tie looks like. Wow, that's that's fancy, man. I don't think you're gonna really find anything like this uh, here in America. I almost don't want to unravel it because I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get it in here as neat as they put it in here. Um, but yeah, this is pretty cool. I haven't got a chance to play these games yet. I have a Vita, and it is honestly probably one of the systems I play the most because uh, I'm I'm always um, commuting back and forth to work. So I don't know who, what character this tie belongs to. But I do plan on playing this game. I'm just been kind of waiting for uh, some sort of bundle or decent sell or something like that. This game doesn't really go and sell because it's a Vita exclusive and it's considered to be a very good game. So I am looking forward to playing it, but um, don't know when I'm going to find the time to wear this tie. I, I don't really like white stuff. I'm not going to lie. Uh, like when it comes to clothing items and things like that, I feel like they have a tendency to get dirty very easily. So that's the second item there. Very cool. Um, let's move on to the next one. Alright, <clears throat> so there's the big one. Uh, uh, okay, this is a magnet and dry erase board maybe? For a uh, for an assassination classroom. Another item I don't really know <laughs> what I'm going to do with, but uh, it's definitely pretty cool. The main reason why I decided on this box was because they told you six of the animes that were going to be featured in it. And um, we're not going to open this up. We'll just move on to the next item, but that that's pretty cool. Uh, they told you six of the animes that were going to be featured in this crate. So what I decided to do was I decided to... Uh, I'll tell you since I was going to look inside. I decided to do is I was going to... Uh, you know, I was going to get this crate based off of some of the items and animes that interest me. So, this is the loot pen. This this comes in every loot crate. Uh, it's some sort of, I think it may be a, uh, like a, uh, a, a composition notebook or something. These little charms, you can put them on your phone. Uh, so, no, I mean, I don't know if I'm going to find a use for that either. And this is, let's move on to the next one, is from... I don't know what this is. This must be like an exclusive. Uh, it's, a, it's like a couple of different keychains, which I really use keychains quite a bit, but these look kind of fragile. Uh, I don't know if you can see the thing that's on there with the characters and stuff. But it looks like it's multiple pins. It's not just or multiple keychains. It's not just one of the characters. There's like a bunch of these little guys in here. Hope you can see that, guys. I want to go closer, but uh, I'd, have, I'd have to move the light, and I guess I'll have no choice but to try to move the light as close as possible so you can kind of see uh, these little guys. So, yeah, um, there's a bunch of these guys in here. It's like four of them, <laughs> or five of them, or something like that. So, um, that's interesting. These don't, aren't, don't look like they're from any anime in particular. Oh, you know what? Yes, they are. They're from uh, they're from fruit fruit baskets. That's the last anime that was in here. See, the title's in Japanese, so I really wasn't sure what that was. But these are from fruit baskets, so that's uh, something special there. Now, I'm I'm used to shirts being in these boxes. I really don't think there's a shirt in here. Uh, maybe they don't release a shirt with every box. That's a little disappointing because that was the one thing I was pretty sure I was going to be excited about. But I think there is at least one or two more items in this box, so. Let's find out what it is. Uh, oh, okay, this is pretty cool. Uh, this is a Persona manga for Persona 3. 3. <clears throat> mm. 
know what just happened there. Lost my voice. Uh, you know, so uh, I guess it's for it's a volume one. <laughs> These are Loot Crate's exclusive, so I don't really know. Yeah, I, I don't know why they uh, <laughs> why they do the mangas because there's only one volume. It's not like you collect the, all of them. They're not gonna release them all through Loot Crate. Maybe they. They're not going to release the, the rest of the volumes in the store, but just leave this one exclusive to Loot Crate. So I don't know what the, the mentality behind these mangas are. I guess if you've never really uh, gotten into the show or the anime, I guess they feel like the manga will, will kind of get you invested in it, and then you can kind of, you know, explore other venues to, to see it, you know, other ways. But <clears throat> uh, So there's that, and this is the last item, which is looking pretty disappointing. This is from... Digimon Adventure Try And I don't know what it is uh, I'm almost scared to even open it up It looks like a postcard it, This looks pretty This is pretty disappointing <laughs> uh, I, can't even, I can't even hide my Disappointment uh, with this crate uh, uh, If I'm just being honest Like this The fact that it didn't really come with a t-shirt Maybe this item will be the one To really sell it But I think these are postcards or something I, I can't even tell what this is yeah, they're just, they're like little posters. Um, I guess that's pretty cool. I I, I don't... <clears throat> Alright, I'm pretty sure you guys can tell how disappointed I am. It's great. It's not, I can't use any of this stuff, to be honest. Like, I have no use for most of this stuff. But, um, that's kind of the gamble that you take. Uh, because I had no idea what was in this crate, so you just kind of either luck in or you luck out or whatever the heck I'm trying to say here. There's a poster that comes with it, which is actually going to be pretty beneficial because um, I'm going to be doing another setup uh, to so that the, the presentation from the videos can be a, a bit nicer. Um, I'm going to be setting up in another room, and I want to put some posters and stuff on the wall, so. If, this is probably the best item in this box for me, uh, the one that I know for a fact I'll probably use, and it's a uh, back to school poster. Um, <clears throat> it's gonna be difficult to show this entire thing in here. Uh, <laughs> I guess I'll, what I'll do is I'll start from the bottom here and I'll just kind of scan it up, like pan it up, like, zzzz, and you guys can kind of can kind of get an idea of the entire poster as I go up. But, uh, there you have it. That is the loot crate for the month of September or August. I, I don't really know which month it is because I ordered it in, in August, but it came in September. So, this might be September's loot crate, but I, you guys will know based on the title. And some people like to see kind of what the inside of the box looks like because they usually put, like, a pretty cool design in there. Well, this, is, uh, this is the design they chose for this month. I guess it's like a, a lunch box or something maybe, or like a desk, school desk, I, I, I don't know. Loot anime, I gotta do better man, because I've seen every crate up until this point. But I'm going to go into like a little bit of a rant here, so I just want to thank you guys for watching. Um, I uh, had a pretty... This, this was fun, I'll say that. I was really excited about this. And maybe that has something to do with why I was a little disappointed because of the hype and the excitement of not knowing what's going to be in the box and if these things will ever really live up to your expectations. So, um, I just want to thank you guys for watching. Uh, I may do another one next month, but I was severely disappointed by this one. Uh, but if you guys like this video, please uh, please subscribe, please like. Uh, I would like to do more of these. And like I said, I will most likely be the first person to open these each month. But in celebration of my first loot crate, I have some items here. Some Japanese snacks. A little sodi pop here. And some pocky. So I'm going to eat these. And... Sob. <laughs>